Hello, Friday 19th December and I want to show you the progress with the electric motor mounts. There's our electric motor in the frame that we built ourselves during lockdown and it's resting on two pieces of timber at the moment. It's very slightly high, that's the aqua drive there which is not quite perfectly aligned but what's happening next is we've fitted one, two crossbars. I've got the flexible mounts bolted to those crossbars and now the next step is to have a piece of timber that runs the full length of the motor so it goes under both mounts just to tie it all together nicely and that's resting on this angle bracket which isn't yet fixed to the boat. So we've got four of these meaty angle brackets and what I'm going to do rather than just relying on that that will the little piece will go there and then a longer piece here to rest on the original bearer and then these three pieces of timber are all going to be epoxy coated epoxied together and through bolted as well so the load can be transmitted directly through the timber onto the original bearer as well as through the right angle and by doing this I can get the timbers um, perfectly level to the original bearers and that will position the angle brackets uh, perfectly so I can then drill and fit them. It's going to mean taking the motor out to be able to get access to do that drilling. That's partly why I want to have a rigid frame here holding those brackets in exactly the right place before I take the motor out and um, uh, drill those holes. That's where we're at at the moment. Plenty of other jobs happening, but I thought you'd like to see where we are with the electric motor mount before Christmas. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and leave comments. Bye.